Hello everyone, my name is Zach from owensatm.com and today I'm going to show you how to set up the Copay Bitcoin wallet on your Android device. So let's get started. First I'm going to click on the Play Store icon to pull up our Play Store and in the top search bar we're going to type in Copay and it should be this one here on the list, Copay Bitcoin wallet make sure it is by BitPay Incorporated. So go ahead and click install. And this will download and install itself here. And when it's done, go ahead and click open. Here, let's get started by clicking get started. Uh, make sure you read through this information here, just a quick overview of uh, you know, what Bitcoin is and what you're downloading here and then go ahead and click create wallet now uh, this will encrypt your wallet key this is important because if another uh, application on your phone uh, is uh, wants to access for some reason your Bitcoin wallet it might be able to steal all of your Bitcoin so we need to be careful here and encrypting your wallet's a good thing so uh, choose a password you're not going to forget. And click OK. Confirm your password. And your wallet's created. And if you want to see, receive email notifications, you can fill that out. I'm not really interested in that, so let's continue. Now you want to back up your Bitcoin wallet. This is a very important step because if you break your phone or you know uh, something happens, you want to be able to recover your Bitcoin. So go ahead and click back up your wallet. It's going to ask you that nobody's watching you. I mean, if you have your back to a security camera, that's even bad. So you know, make sure that uh, you're by yourself when you back this up. and do not take a screenshot of it. You want to physically write down your backup words. Now once you've written these words down, and make sure you write them down in that order, uh, go ahead and click I've written it down. And now you're going to put them back in the correct order from how you wrote them down. Just to confirm that you wrote them down correctly, because if you don't write these down correctly and something does happen to your Bitcoin, you're going to go and try to recover them, and they're not going to be there, which is really bad. Uh, make sure we have all these in the right order. Now, your words will be different from mine, and don't use my words there because <laughs> somebody else might view the video and steal your funds. So make sure you write down your own words. And now your wallet is set up. Now you might wonder, what am I supposed to do with these words? Maybe you should put them in an envelope and put them in a safe or you know, put it in your safety deposit box at a bank or uh, in your jewelry box or uh, under your mattress. I'm not sure. Wherever you can safely keep things that someone is not going to steal, that is where you should keep them. So now our wallet is set up, and the most important feature of our wallet here is clicking this Receive button at the bottom left-hand corner. This is our Bitcoin address, and this is our Bitcoin QR code with all these crazy little squares. Um, if you're making a purchase from an ATM machine, or if uh, someone is trying to send you Bitcoin from their phone or computer, you want to show them this address here that starts with a 1, or this big fancy QR code here and that is how you will receive your Bitcoin. Now that we've downloaded our Copay wallet, it's time to make a purchase at the ATM machine. Go ahead and tap on uh, Buy Bitcoin, and the machine will ask you how much you're planning to put in. Now, obviously today we're going to put in less than $2,000, so we're going to go ahead and click that. 
So now you're going to have to agree to our privacy policy here, and the machine is going to send a text message to your phone. So we're going to click I agree, and now we need to type in our phone number with area code. And click OK. It's went ahead and sent the text message to your phone with a code that you need to now type into the machine. And our code here right now is 46158. And go ahead and click OK. And if your code is correct, it'll let you continue here to the uh, Bitcoin address page. Now, up here in this box here in the corner, we need to show the ATM our Bitcoin QR code. Now that can be found in our Copay app that we just downloaded. So go ahead and pull open your Copay app on your phone. And at the bottom left-hand corner of the screen, click Receive. And you should see a Bitcoin address and a QR code. We want to hold that QR code up to this box here in the corner. Now the ATM machine has picked up our Bitcoin address. And you can even compare the one that it has here at the bottom corner, the, le the left-hand corner of the ATM to the address that's on your Bitcoin wallet to make sure that it's correct. Now you're ready to start inserting cash. So we're going to put in $20. So now the machine's going to tell us how much we have inserted, which is $20, and currently that's 0 0.001782 Bitcoin. So if that's it and we're all done and we don't want to insert any more money, we just go ahead and click over here in the bottom right hand corner, Buy Bitcoins. The machine processes the transaction, and now it asks you if you would like a receipt. If not, just click Done. If you'd like a re receipt, click Send Receipt. For your receipt, you can receive one by text message or email. Uh, if you're going to add up your costs of Bitcoin at the end of the year, I usually recommend email. So then you can go ahead and type in your email address here. We'll type in our demo address. There's a little check mark there at the bottom of the keyboard if you can't see the done button. But when you're all done, click done. And that went ahead and sent you an email receipt. You can click done. And that's the end of our transaction. Now it might take a few minutes, but if you pull open your Copay app, you'll at some point see your Bitcoin arrive there. Like I said, it's all dependent on your Copay app, how often it updates with the server to check your account balance. But usually within 30 minutes to an hour, you will see your balance there. Uh, other wallets, or sometimes the Copay wallet, will show up instantly, but not always. So just be patient. And if you have any trouble, just call the number posted on the uh, ATM machine or send it a text message if it accepts it.